Moving on to Monday Night Football, the last game of our preview week, we have... Do you know what, UK fans, don't worry about it. Go to bed. Um, it, <laughs> it's one that they just had to put it on because they got to give them a prime time slot for the season. Uh, it's one fifteen am You're not going to stay up and watch this. Uh, Seahawks, Washington. Um, wow. Yeah, don't worry about it. Um, Seahawks, I don't know what they are anymore. Uh, I've got no idea if, if Russell... They, really, they are a bang average team. I think yeah. they're, they're not sugarcoating it. And I think that... Why you think why is Pete Carroll doing a job? Yeah, um, injuries is what people are just going to say, aren't they? Yeah, but I'm not being fair. Their defense hasn't been good for at least five, six seasons. They had their time in really 2013, 2014. Then they then they made the worst play call in history, and they've not come close since, have they? And I think that they've been living off Russell Wilson doing magic plays to fluke wins in the past, where he would launch it to. But they like to lock it, DK Metcalf, but they were abysmal against the Cardinals team, which have been injury hit. You think no Hopkins, no Murray, and the Cardinals won that easy. And yeah. um, as I say, and I think with the Seahawks, and again as well, uh, Green Bay were abysmal. And I think the only reason that I've got reckon this will be a close game is that just because Washington can't play that well again like they did in Carolina. But defensively, I think that. It, I, I think Carl Heineke will actually have a pretty average game, but it will come down to the fact that that Washington defence will force turnovers off Seattle because Seattle have just been dreadful this season. I think they've been one of the worst teams to watch this season. Yeah, I mean, they've got obviously DK Metcalf, Tyler Lock, uh, but there's just nothing else like the running game. Again, the running game's been poor for about four or five yeah, years they, now. They, they, yeah, they, can't keep Chris, they can't keep uh, Chris Carson fit, so they need yeah. to move on. But even he's not good enough. Like he, he has never yeah. been. He's never been good enough. Like he's not. He's not a Marshall Lynch. That's 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 you know the last good running back they had. Not when he come back out of retirement, but when he actually yeah wasn't eating skills. That, that was embarrassing as well because that shows you how desperate Seattle were, weren't they? For yeah, just for that one playoff game. Uh, Pete Carroll signed a uh, contract extension until twenty twenty five um, last November. Oh, last November. Yeah. Imagine if it was it's like last bad. week. <laughs> yeah, twenty twenty five. I mean. Contracts do mean nothing um, nowadays anyway. but It means you'll get more of a payoff, won't it? The play calling is just simply not good enough. He's like, And he's cut cord on us as well. He needs to reassess that because they're clearly not making the right plays because Seattle, as I say, I think are quite an e- easy team to face defensively now. Uh, I've got Washington 23-16. Uh, 